Hey guys, I hope everyone is having a great holiday season so far. And if you're anything like me, you love your friends and you're wondering what to get them. I don't want to give them something big, especially if they didn't get me anything. I don't want them to feel like, ah, oh, I didn't get you anything, now I have to go shopping. I didn't want to do anything like major. I wanted to spend $20 or less, uh, but I did want to get them something just to show them that I love them and I appreciate them. So I come up with a gift for them that I think is really thoughtful. I think they'll really love it. Uh, but at the same time, it wasn't A, too expensive, and B, I didn't have to slave over it and spend an entire afternoon dirtying up my kitchen, making treats. So in this video, I am going to show you guys what I got my friends for Christmas. So first, I'm going to start with my friend Betsy, and I just have a box here. It came with like the wrap that you put around it, but I'm just going to leave it as is. And then I have some tissue paper here, so I'm going to put that right there. And then the ornament that I got her is this ornament right here and they are very outdoorsy people they love to camp and hunt and things like that and so i thought that this was just a perfect little ornament for them so we have a candy store uh near us that everyone raves about i had actually never been there but it's the mountain man nut and fruit company and I've heard a lot of people say really great things about this company, so I went inside and oh my goodness, I had a field day. So I'm pretty sure that she likes licorice as far as I can remember, and I think she likes black licorice. And this has red and black licorice in it. She also loves raspberries, and I'm pretty sure I was in the store with her one time and she had mentioned these raspberries, not from this specific company, but um, these like little candy gummy raspberries that you can buy. And she said that she loved these. So when I saw these, I just had to get them for her. And Betsy is actually the one that told me about this store and she said that they had really good popcorn. So of course I got her some popcorn and it's just some caramel popcorn. So I have the popcorn in here with some tissue paper the raspberries and the licorice. And then I have some Christmassy ribbon. And then I'm just going to slide on the ornament. And that is her gift. So next I have these clear bags and they have some snowflakes on them. And these were just a couple of dollars. So for my friend Elizabeth, I got her some Andy's mints, who doesn't love those, and some lint chocolate because I know that these two are her favorite. And I am just going to fill it up. You can just give the bag and just tie a bow around it with the ornament on top of it. But since I'm giving her two bags, it would be kind of hard to do that. So I am going to put it inside of this bag. And I'm putting plenty in there so she can share with her kids and her husband or she can just keep it for herself. So now I have some red ribbon that I'm going to tie around it. And then I just printed off some free Christmas tags off the internet and I will link this link down below. I'm going to do this one. Plop that on there. And then I have her ornament here, which is a little Santa Claus on top of a reindeer. So for my friend Nailini, they don't have any kids, it's just him and her, just like us, and I got her some of her favorite sparkling cider here. You can also use wine, but we don't drink, and none of our friends drink. Then I'm gonna use my red ribbon again, and then I'm cutting out another little tag here. I put this through, just like that. Then I have their ornament, and I'm going that through. And there you have their Christmas gift. So for my friend Linda, I know that her kids love candy canes and this is the Lifesaver candy cane flavors. Then I made her these treats here and I'm going to put these inside of a little plastic bag as well and I will show you guys how I made these treats. So first you're gonna need some pretzels. I used these square kinds. And then you're gonna need some Hershey Kisses and some M&Ms. 
So the very first thing that I did was I put my M&Ms inside of a bowl because once you take these out of the oven, you are gonna have to work very quickly and so you don't wanna be fiddling around with a bag. Next, I dumped the pretzels onto the cookie sheet and then I just arranged them out a bit, spacing them about half an inch away from each other so that when the chocolate melts, they don't get stuck to each other. Then you're going to start unwrapping each Hershey Kiss and then you're going to put the Hershey Kiss on the center of each pretzel. Once you're all done with those, you're going to put it in a 275 degree oven for three minutes or until they just start becoming melted. Once you pull them out of the oven, you're gonna have to work a little quickly because you don't want the Hershey Kisses to start to set again. So you are going to grab a M&M and then you're gonna plop it right on the center of the Hershey Kiss and then you're going to push down with your finger gently. Once you're done with those, you're going to put them in your refrigerator and let them set completely. So now I have all of the treats in the bag and I'm going to tie it up with some ribbon again. So then I'm going to take some more red ribbon and I'm just going to wrap the box in it. And then I have her ornament here and I'm going to put that on the string as well. So that's what it looks like so far, but I am just going to tape this little bag down and then doing the loop-de-loop thingamabob. I'm just gonna put it right there. Right there. And then just flop it on. And that's my gift for Linda and her family. I just love how quick and simple these gifts were to make and put together. They were also inexpensive. I didn't spend more than $20 on any of these gifts, but some of them, like this guy right here, was only like $5 to make. And even though I didn't spend all day in the kitchen and having a sink full of dishes at the end of it, I think that these are very thoughtful gifts at the same time. Who doesn't love their favorite holiday treat during the holidays? And I just love that when the treat is all gone, they still have their little ornament from me that they can pull out year after year. So I hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video and maybe you got some ideas on what to give your friends for the holidays. And leave me a comment down below if you have any fun and simple gift ideas to give your friends. I hope that you guys are having a great holiday season so far and Christmas is like a week away or something crazy like that. I cannot believe it and I'm just so, so, so excited. Thanks again for watching. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!